Hello there. Wow. Perfect. Wonderful. Well done. What is up everybody, the Nintendo Beast here. We are jumping back into Animal Crossing City Folk here on the Nintendo Wii. Let's get started. I am John. So let's jump in here. Now I do actually have sort of an itinerary of what I plan on doing in today's live stream, or not live stream, let's play. Ugh, I'm all over the place. Anywho, what else is new, right? All right, so first of all, here we are. We are one week out of Halloween here in Animal Crossing City Folk. I got a letter from the Happy Room Academy. Uh, the Happy Room Academy. Uh, hey, John, your room earned 49,611 points. Bang. Your pieces? Most of them? Nice. Rare. Impressive. We're giving you a lucky bonus. Congrats. Okay, cool. Don't know exactly what in there was rare or... But, you know, whatever. So there's nothing going on today, I don't think. But let me jump up here and see... So what I do plan on doing today is kind of putting together a list of uncaught fish and bugs, um, as well as unobtained art and gyroids, and so that way in the future Let's Play episodes we can move forward and actually start, you know, finding them, if at all possible. Um, and you know, also begin the per said pursuit of those Okay, wait a second. Somebody's got fleas. It sounds like it's Bunny. No, it's... What's her name over here? Mallory? Is it Mallory? Mallory, yeah. Fleas again? Yuck, yuck, yuck. Oh, why? It can only be one thing. All those mud facials. What a price to pay for a radiant face like mine. Quack, pfft. Uh, yeah, no, I'd stop doing that if, if it's giving you fleas. I don't, I don't think it's worth it, but. So it's super fall, fall colors here in Animal Crossing City Folk, as opposed, especially to Animal Crossing, uh, New Horizons right now. Doesn't even look even, it barely looks even remotely like fall. I mean, it's kind of getting fallish, I guess. But here in City Folk, it's super, super fallish. Let me pick those up. Here's some fun thing you can do in this game. If you pick little dandelions like this, I don't know if it, this is in New Horizons. I don't think I've seen uh, dandelions. But anyway, you can blow on them. So that's all, you know, that's cute. Anyway. <laughs> So let me check, first of all. <laughs> Not Able Sisters. Lots of weeds. I guess I gotta start signing on more frequently so I don't grow weeds every week. <laughs> okay, so the first Animal Crossing on GameCube allows you to buy two pieces of candy a day. City Folk lets you buy one piece a day. New Horizons lets you buy one piece a day. The difference between New Horizons and City Folk, though, obviously, is that uh, City Folk, you buy it and it's sold out. New Horizons, it's not sold out, it just limits your purchase, so that way you have to, uh, or you can still... Oh, what is this? A lab bench. <laughs> yeah, I'll take that for my Halloween room, too. Um... But yeah, you can go to different people's islands and buy more candy in New Horizons. <laughs> I forget, was I really looking for... I forget what I was looking for. For my Halloween decorations in my house. <laughs> but that lab bench looks like a Frankenstein type of bench. I think that'll be pretty cool. 
Maybe I'll put that next to the flask I remember I have in my bed or in my living room there. So what do I have in my pockets right now? A whole lot of nothing. I got a flea. Uh, my debit card. Candy, silver can, blah, 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 blah. Yada, 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 so on and so forth. Let me... Oh, wait a second. I hear birdies. That means there's some kind of announcement on the bulletin board. It might just be saying Halloween's this week. Yeah. October 31st is Halloween. Have you all got your costumes and candy ready? And the flea market this weekend. Wait a second. That might be, like, tomorrow or something. So I might get in that flea market. That that might be part of uh, next week. Let ne next week's let's play. I can't even speak. What is going on? Anyway, um, I think flea markets happen on Saturdays. I don't know. Does it say when it's gonna be? Let me pick all these weeds over here. <laughs> I don't think it said where, when it's gonna be. Oops. It just says this weekend. <laughs> ah! Gotta get myself out of the pitfall. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so let me run back to my house real quick. And then we'll, uh, we'll look at some of the, we'll look at my catalogs, not my catalogs, but my itinerary, my, I don't know what the word is, it's closer to, more, more so catalog than itinerary. Uh, we're getting further away from what it actually is. Lab bench. Yeah, that's pretty dope. I like that a lot. Alright. <laughs> so it's kind of spooky Halloween in here a little bit, right? So, yeah, what is... I don't know what is actually turn. My encyclopedia, I guess. My critterpedia. That's the word I was looking for. My critterpedia. Oops. Nope. <laughs> so... Let me pull up the fandom app on my phone. For anybody who plays Animal Crossing, whether it's New Horizons, New Leaf, City Folk, the original, Wild World, uh, whatever. If you're playing Animal Crossing, even Pocket Camp, I imagine, uh, you can benefit greatly. There's an eel there. Maybe a moray eel? I don't know. But you can benefit greatly from the uh, the fandom app, or f I think it's probably fandom.com. Not totally sure. Uh, but they have an Animal Crossing wiki that helps so, 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 so much. It's like having a, the paper guide in your hand uh, without actually having to have the paper guide in your hand. So. so let me see. City folk. Uh, let's do bugs first. So let's pop over to bugs. So how many do we have? We need one. Oh, cool. Does it go in order? Oh my god, it does. Okay. So we still need the peacock butterfly. Flies near hybrid flowers. The peacock butterfly, does that... When is that available? Summertime, not now. Okay. Bummer. Alright, so next... We'll keep scrolling through here. So the common butterfly, the emperor butterfly. How did I never catch an emperor butterfly? What? Near flowers anywhere. Uh... Ah, oh, crap. Most of these butterflies are all... Summer, unfortunately. 
So we need the peacock butterfly, the emperor butterfly. Let's see, between the moth. Jeez, an oak silk moth. Now these big guys, June to September, missed it by a month. Are you kidding? <laughs> okay. We're not on a good, we're not at a good start here so far. So we need to spend more time over the summer, I guess. Maybe we'll time travel. I don't know. Probably not. I don't want to, but. <laughs> so in the cicada region, we have orchid mantis. Four different kinds of cicadas, right? Yeah. Lantern fly. The lantern fly. June to September. <laughs> All right, so we're tanking hard. Clearly, we played. Clearly, in the past, I've played this more over the winter than the or yeah, over the winter than the summer because all the winter things seemingly are already caught. Um. So the two dragonflies, three dragonflies. So the third one is a banded dragonfly. So we're two dragonflies. We're looking for the banded dragonfly and the giant petal tail. <laughs> City folk, July to August for the banded and the giant petal tail. August to October. So we only have a couple more days to get this petal tail dragonfly. Where is it? Five to seven p.m. Okay, we're doing this now. We're going hunting for a dragonfly. That's what we need in our live our lives right now. So we're looking for a petal tail dragonfly. You can't see it probably, but that's what we're looking for here. We're on the hunt down after a petal tail dragonfly. Do I have a silver net? No, I don't. Okay. So we only have... What is this? Okay, can I catch it, though? That'd be swell if I could catch it. That's definitely not it. That's a red dragonfly, right? Okay. So let me see. It's like 6.30. They go away at like 7 o'clock, apparently. These petal tail dragonflies. Crap. That looks like a red dragonfly to me, but I can't totally 100% tell. Where'd it go? It bailed real quick. I imagine the dragonflies are going to be kind of close to the river. It's also It also said that it's unknown whether or not they're uh, out during like rain. I could be totally wrong though. <laughs> they might not even be near the river. But we do only have a couple of uh, about 30 minutes to try to catch this thing. <laughs> and these are just to complete the Critterpedia. That's not even commenting on how many of these are not even in the museum yet. But with that being said, from here on out, we're going to donate them all directly to the museum as I catch them. Because it's not like I need the money anymore, right? <laughs> so... Maybe it says, maybe it has some kind of hint on here. <laughs> 5 to 7 p.m., so we're perfect timing. They're scarce. It's a bug found in August through October in the evening. It's called the Giant Petal Tail Rider New Leaf. Uh, rare bug and sells for 8,000 bells. It is dark in color and is easily identifiable by its immense size. 
being similar in body length to the player's height. What? That thing's freaking. It's massive. And swift flying ability, making it difficult to catch. Okay, so this thing is literally a freaking giant. So it's not going to be difficult to identify this thing, apparently. Of course, the one we're looking for is rare, though. <laughs> so I guess from here on out, it's just going to be a matter of... <laughs> every episode moving forward of this Let's Play is going to be trying to hunt the rare petal... F petal... tail... whatever. <laughs> Dragonfly. We'll head to the city at, like, 7. You know, once my chances of catching this petal tail are completely gone. <laughs> Depending on how this goes, maybe I'll start doing a live stream, too. I'll do a live stream every night at 5 o'clock. For the remainder of October, or of October, to uh, try to catch this darn thing, I feel like it probably primarily flies around water. Nearly the, in length, nearly the size of my, how tall my character is, though. That's insane. So, like, yeah, not that one, obviously. That's just a little buzzing red one. This guy is going to be absolutely massive. But again, it does seem like they're primarily around water. Which would stand, which would definitely stand to reason, right? This game is so mind-numbingly relaxing, though. If not for the fact that I'm about to encounter, hopefully, hopefully, uh, a giant... I don't really have time for you, but what's up? What's up, Mary? Hey there, John. Hmm, you know what? The name John is kind of a mouthful. Is it? <laughs> is it really? Okay. Three letters. I can't... I've got a great idea for a new nickname. Want to hear it? You bet. Totally want to hear it, right? Okay, here it goes. Popstar. Popstar? John. Uh, sure, I love that. Great. Uh, seems like a bit of more of a mouthful than John, but, you know. Whatever. You think they fly by the ocean? No, it seems like it's primarily the freshwater rivers that the dragonflies fly over. And these little puddles are these little pondy pond things. They are worth 8,000 bells, apparently, too, though. I don't know if I said that before when I was reading it. But being rare, they are apparently worth a lot of money. Which would be tempting in any game other than this one. Because in this game, I have, like, infinite monies. But 
Which I almost have infinite monies in New Horizons, too. It's not infinite, but it's... I have everything paid off in New Horizons. Um, and I still have, like, 9 million bells or something like that. So not infinite, like, in this game. Like, this game, I have a, I literally have a maxed out bank account. It's, like, 999 million, 999,999 bells. But, um... Come on. Come on, Petal Tail. The hunt for the Petal Tail Dragonfly begins. It would be nice to actually catch it today. I don't really believe that the odds of me catching it today are good, but... fish <laughs> he 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 ha 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 ho 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 I don't know why I'm running up here but just felt the need to get away from that little area. I don't know... See, I know in previous Animal Crossing games... Dragonflies just kind of flew wherever they felt like it, I think. But in this game, it really does seem like the dragonflies primarily fly over... Water. Like, bodies of water. wanted to kind of run away from the water and see if I could come back and it'd be refreshed maybe maybe some new uh, new dragonflies spawning doesn't appear to be the case but I was hopeful <laughs> I got so excited, I was like, oh, but no, it's, that's not nearly big enough to be the dragonfly that I am looking for. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. How much time is left? We're running out of time, people. We got like 20 minutes. There's another stupid little one. I'm just ex I'm just waiting, dude. I'm waiting to see this giant dragonfly. Okay, so this one's not near water, though. Whatever that little guy is. I think they're all just, like, red dragonflies. And then there's just the petal tail. Which I can just imagine is going to be like a terrifying find. Wherever it may be. Should I go inside a building and then come back out, maybe? Maybe refresh the map, see if it's... See if someone spawns. I don't know if it matters. All I know is I'm going to feel like a little bit of a failure if I don't catch this pedal tail. We're like, what, 24 minutes into the Let's Play today? It's going to be a complete waste of time. Just kidding, it's not going to be a complete waste of time. Uh, it's going to be a complete waste of time if I don't catch this pedal tail. <laughs> and just scrub to the end of the video and see if I caught it. Just kidding.
It's gonna be an epic quest trying to catch this pedal tail. I can already tell. So I might go inside, um... What is that? That's a little... little guy. Okay. Let me go inside somewhere. See if that changes the game at all. I forget where I was going to go inside, though, and for what purpose. What's up, Walker? Neat, kiddo. It looks like you've got yourself a flea there. What? Do you want it? I've been really wanting one of those, too, but I hardly get any allowance. I just ripped this off your neighbor's head for free, anyway. Do you think you could trade it to me for my groovy wall? Okay. See, this always happens, though. I catch a flea, and then somebody trades something for it, and then somebody else tries to trade me a flea back. <laughs> so I'm gonna e I promise you, I'll probably end off this Let's Play with a flea in my pocket still, even though I just traded that one away. I was gonna go in a building, but I forget what building I was gonna go into. <laughs> There's a dragonfly. It's a little red dragonfly. Yeah, go in the water. I still don't remember what, um, the guy's name is that I, that I referenced last week or like two weeks ago or something in my Let's Play. The guy that gives away balloons and stuff at, uh, Phineas. I just remembered his name right off the spot. Phineas. Phineas is his name. Prize given is this game. <laughs> so we'll go to the city then and see maybe if, uh... There's Domo up in the sky. My Domo constellation. But we'll go and we'll see if Phineas is there. We'll see if Red is there. Well, Red's always there, but we'll see if Red's open and if he has any artwork for me. Hopefully not fake. But we'll do that at 7. Uh, as soon as I am 100% certain that I will not be catching a pedal tail today. <laughs> what is that? Or as soon as I do. Optimism. Out of the way, Harry. I'm looking for something. I'm not seeing a pedal tail. Like, I know they're rare and all, but, like, didn't expect them to be this rare. <laughs> Where I couldn't find it within 30 seconds. But yeah, no, we're, we are cutting it, like, cutting it kind of close. We definitely need to, uh, to catch one of these things before October ends. Or else, we'll be crap out of luck.
I definitely should have started playing this game again over the summer. I feel dumb, because I know for a fact, like, fall and uh, winter are terrible times to try to catch bugs and fish. And since those are, like, that's where I'm lacking in the game, it's gonna be, uh... Yeah. Get in the water. Go. I command you. Sploosh. There you go. <laughs> I don't... I'm not even gonna totally be sure what to think when I do see this thing. <laughs> okay, so there's another little red one, right? Yeah. They do seem to be, you know, primarily by the the water, though. <laughs> like, yeah, you might see one elsewhere, but for the most part, I find most of them by the water. Most of these red dragonflies. So I can only assume that's going to be a similar situation. Pedal tail, the elusive pedal tail. Yeah, I'm not seeing him anywhere. Oh my god, I'm just literally just sleepily walking up and down the river here. Alright, so let's... We might abandon ship here. Oh, what is that thing? Little? Little red thing? Yeah. Crap. I literally saw that thing spawn, and I was like, ooh. And it, look, it looked small on the horizon, but it thought I thought it could be big if I got close to it, but it didn't really get much bigger as I got closer to it. Just kind of, kind of was what it was. Any petal tail dragonflies? Are more than welcome to reveal yourself to me. What is that? Alright, so they do kind of. Here's one by the beach. So I guess they could be by the beach. I guess they really could be anywhere, right? It's wishful thinking that they'd be in a specific area, but these things... Another red one, okay. Could, I guess, literally be anywhere. Cricket, okay. Scared me. All right, so we got a fossil. If nothing else, we got some fossils out of this endeavor. Oops. All right. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Just itching my nose. Okay, so... As we run around and don't see anything even remotely close to a petal tailed dragonfly. I have to imagine our odds are getting more and more slim as we approach, we are less than 10 minutes away from seven o'clock. 
and my expedition will be coming to a close at that point. <laughs> Maybe it's the pumpkin head. Maybe the pumpkin head is scaring them away. <laughs> or maybe not. <laughs> I don't know. Just rambling at this point. Just sleepily walking along the river. If I wasn't recording this Let's Play right now, I'd probably be asleep. I'd probably just have passed out by now. Just running back and forth up the river, just... Trying to catch a petal tail dragonfly. Picking some weeds on the way, too. You know, doing some good for the community. That kind of stuff. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. Uh, well, it's less than 10 minutes now, so I'll do that afterwards. But I was thinking about checking to see what my rating was. Like, what my town rating was and see if I needed to do anything. I imagine it's going to tell me that I need more flowers. Because while my tree... I have plenty of trees, and they're all in the grid form that is supposed to be good for town raiding. Uh, whoops, I didn't mean to pick that up. Flowers, I have close to none. Except for the ones that are just randomly kind of growing by themselves without any effort from me around town, like these ones right here and whatnot. <laughs> what is that guy? That's a red one, okay. There are just infinite red dragonflies, very similar to the original Animal Crossing game on GameCube, where they're just freaking everywhere. It's kind of cool in the original Animal Crossing, though. Um, look at them, they're everywhere. They, uh, they move in packs, almost. Which is kind of cool. Like, if you don't just find, like, one red dragonfly, you'll find, like, four of them together, flying around. Okay, so... <laughs> Plenty of crickets. I'm just gonna assume that I have all of them, right? All the nest, all the possible crickets. Oh crap! I didn't mean to do that. There's a huge area. Did I not catch any crickets? What the? F what? I don't think I caught any crickets. Which means all these crickets I've been running right by this entire time? I should have been catching. It's underneath me. Okay. There we go. I caught a cricket. That's the ticket. So I'm just going to start catching things, and... I'll just go to the museum afterwards. At, like, 7 o'clock, I'll run down to the museum to see if Blathers needs any of the stuff that I caught. If he does, great. If he doesn't, also great, I guess. I don't care. But I didn't see any crickets in there. I'm suddenly realizing the folly of my ways and how much I didn't care about things I should have cared about in this game. Like the completion of a museum and stuff. All I cared about was making money and getting things. Okay, so we definitely have more crickets than we'll need now, but... Oops. I don't know what kind of cricket that was. I think there, they should be a, there should be a bell cricket in here, too, somewhere, right? How did I miss that? Crap. This thing is resisting jumping off the cliff, but it's still probably going to end up off the cliff. Don't you dare. Don't do it. You got so much to live for, Cricket. Okay, got it. There's a bell, Cricket. Okay. How much bells is it worth? I'm not super worried about the bells right now. The fact of the matter is, I don't think I caught any Crickets up until right now. 
That's just a regular cricket, I think. I'll catch it anyway, but... Now watch, now that I, all my uh, pockets are full, now we'll randomly see a uh, petal tail dragonfly. And I won't have space for it. And I'll accidentally throw it away or something. Oh, boy. I'm not going to go after that. I think I have grasshoppers. I think. Uh, I could be totally wrong. Who knows? This is why I need to put together a list. Is that a regular cricket? It's gonna kill itself. Okay, it killed itself anyway, so. Okay. There's another one. I wasn't even near that one, and it, it killed itself too. We got a bunch of suicidal crickets here today. <laughs> Time is it? Oh boy, we got like two minutes until seven. If that. And then there's no chance for the rest of the day to catch a uh, petal tail dragonfly. My question is like, like they definitely stop spawning at that point, right? But what if you're like looking at a petal tail dragonfly right as the clock strikes 7 p.m.? Does it despawn? If you catch it, is there a glitch in the matrix? If you catch it at like 701? These are the things I want to know. Probably not. I imagine it's probably just... They stop spawning. Or maybe to avoid that, maybe they stop actually spawning at like... 657 or 8 or something like that. You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know. That it. Yep. Yeah. Saw that coming. Yeah, it does not appear that we're going to catch a uh, petal tail dragonfly tonight. Which is a shame. But, oh god, Harry, what? I'm kind of busy. I've run past you like eight times now, and just now, if you've remembered something. Some people say that my way of speaking is a little gruff. I can see it. Uh, but what can you do about talking like the people you grew up with? It's not as if I'm going to stop. So what do you think about the way I talk? Gra, I don't talk all sticky sweet like that. Do I, Twinkles? Well, you just called me Twinkles, so I can't say that you don't. Uh, man, if the guys in my old neighborhood heard you say that, I'd never hear the end of it. Well, I can just hear it now. Harry is all sunshine and flowers. Let's dance in the meadow. Ugh. Alright, well, it's 7 o'clock. Thanks, Harry, for wasting my time. My last minute. Alright, so no more chance of getting a petal tail dragonfly today. So my dreams are crushed for the night. Let me go to the museum real quick and uh, cash in on these crickets. <laughs> I might have just missed them as I was going through, but I, all, I, I definitely did not see them. Just out of curiosity, did I donate that one already? <laughs> already been done with it. Okay. Okay, okay, it's fine. It's fine. Just give it back. Just, just. As I gingerly thrust it back in your direction. Yeah, I. Yes. How about a cricket? Do you need a cricket? Hmm, blathers? Alas, a cricket has already been donated. Oh, by my sister. Okay. Interesting. What about a bell cricket? So I guess there are things that have been donated that I just haven't caught personally. Alright, so this one... So the bell cricket is new. 
such a vision of horror, a slick black body, long antennae, and foul wings that shake when it chirps. Black. How can one be expected to abide such an, uh, an odious monster? Bleh. Enough, I say. Our thanks for the donation. We shall endeavor to keep the wretch safe and happy. I think that's it. Thanks, Blathers. Oh, wait, no, I... Uh, check a fossil for me, Blathers. Why don't you? Uh, actually, two. Can I do two? No, one at a time. Got it. Hmm, fascinating. I have you now, Fossil. <laughs> this reluctant beauty tried to remain anonymous, but none resist Blathers. What you have here is an Ankylo skull. An Ankylo? Ankylo? I don't know. Any additional fossils for me to appraise, perchance? Take a look at this one, Blathers. Blathers! Hmm, fascinating. I have you now, Fossil. Aha! To put it simply, this is a parasaur tail. Quite of this, I have no doubt. And thusly, I return it to your safekeeping. Hmm. That is that. I know, I know. <laughs> Alright. So let's, uh... Crickets are all abound. <laughs> Let's go sell some stuff, empty my pockets, make a little bit of coinage, and then we'll head to the city uh, real quick before we sign off for the day. So we're selling this dragonfly, this skull, this cricket, this cricket, this cricket, the sand dollar, and this tail. Also, I should probably sell that wallpaper, or that flooring, too, because, you know, I don't want it. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get rid of that, the groovy wall, too. <laughs> sure. Cost me nothing but a flea, so. Ain't no thing but a flea. <laughs> All right, let's head to the city now, boy. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, no. Let's go to the town hall real quick and get this eval. Just you know, for future reference. Oh no, it's at this window. Uh, the environment. Alright then, let me read you some of the comments we've received from the townsfolk here. Hmm, it's not a passing grade, but it's not a failing grade either. I'd give it a D plus, maybe a C minus on a good day. Wow. They really hate this town. And that's the report. Hmm, maybe people are sending in these comments because there's not enough greenery in some areas. Now, is there anything else I can help you with? Greenery? There's only so much you can plant. You can plant trees. And you can plant... Flowers. That's literally it. Are there any pine trees, though? I just realized now, are, it doesn't seem like there are any pine trees. This is shocking to me that I'm just re realizing now that I have no pine trees whatsoever in this entire town. <laughs> so that might be on the to-do list next episode. Plant some damn pine trees. Not a single pine tree. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe that's why they hate me. Because there are plenty of trees. I know that for a fact. 
obviously. Put no pine trees and almost no flowers. So maybe we'll we'll put something together. Okay, so that'll be future episode. Let's head to the city for the end of this one, shall we? <laughs> Bow, bow. Bow, bow. Bow, bow. Alright. So what is what spiel does Cap'n have for me today? Say there, ye cuttlefish. Ye look mighty young, but you're out living on your own in town, yar. Ye wee little minnows. Ye leave your parents' nest younger and younger these days, do ye not? Back when I were a lad, ye only moved out for one or two things, a job or a wedding. Well, I have had both of those things, so... Sorry, Captain. Anyway, uh, yar har, the times, they do change, by gar. Ah, uh, city be coming up. Do ye be having any tissues on ye sprat, nar? Well, off ye go. Be a good minnow and call your folks sometime, will ye? Alrighty. <laughs> I want the city to return. In its in this form. That's what I want. I want to be able to take a... I guess you can't in New Horizons. There's no way to do that. You can't take a bus off the island, can you? Or a train. Nighttime in the city. I think this is the first time I'm doing this, uh, in this Let's Play series. But wait, let me check over here. Is this open, maybe? No, okay, so... Can't get in there today. Okay, so let's go... Well, if it ain't our favorite cousin. A hearty welcome to you, John. <laughs> I don't want any of this stuff, but we have no choice but to buy this painting. <laughs> A dynamic painting. It's crazy price of 3,920 bells. I'll take it. Aha, cousin, cousin, you will not be sorry with this one, and that's a crazy red guarantee. You're a dirty liar, crazy red. Please, take a look around. Let old Red know if anything else strikes your fancy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Every time I walk out the door, give me a letter, why don't you, to invite someone new. There's no multiplayer. Can't invite anybody new. <laughs> Alright, so Phineas usually stands right here. So Phineas is not here today. Or if he was, he left earlier today. Look at his big eyes on this guy. Mo. Where the heck are all the restaurants around here? That's a good question. But no restaurants means no vanilla pudding. I would also be sad if there were no restaurants in a city I lived in or I visited. Anyway, let's head back now. Take me home. Look, we're gonna go see if Blathers thinks this this painting is legit. If it's not, I'm gonna be sad. And today's let's play, this week's let's play, is gonna be total bunk. We donated a bell cricket. We got a bell cricket added to the museum, so there's that. Um, the regular cricket and the bell cricket were both added to my critterpedia, which is also good. Cabin says. Uh, Say, me wee troutlet, ye be positively beaming. Did something in that city fill ye with hope? <clears throat> did ye leave, did you live just a little bit of your life's dream? Well then, Sprat, next time remember that it be your turn to help someone else chase their dreams. Gar, now how be that for the wholesome advice? I got some more, I've got some moments, yar. <laughs> well, we be arriving in Domoburg real soon, lad. Glad to see ye enjoying spending some time on... Wait, glad to see ye enjoy spending time on me bus. Next time ye ride, feel free to call me buddy, yar. It be fine by me. 
All right, so Captain and I, we're we're good. We're we're officially buddies now. He just told me. He said, "Call me buddy." All right, so we're gonna jump off the bus here. We're gonna run down to the museum. I used to chase the bus after it came, after it left, and to see if the like if it was still there. It despawns immediately after it's out of frame, I imagine, but I always used to chase it. Only to find the bitter truth that there is no way in or out of the town. The bus is just magical. <laughs> Alright, Blathers. Don't do me dirty here, man. This is it. Oh, sweet suspense is, is right. Dynamic painting. Come on, don't do me dirty here. What a treat for these eyes. This is the dynamic painting. But. Hork. Oh, Jesus. Ugh. Oh, my God. Red, you did me dirty again, bud. It's like every time, too. It's not even like you have like a 50% chance. It's like 75% of the time it's a fake and like 25% of the time you get something real. <sighs> All right, well that was garbage then. Let me just go dump that somewhere. So uh, this week's Let's Play is kind of a failure. Uh, we didn't catch the Petal Tail Dragonfly. We did catch the Cricket and the Bell Cricket, both of which uh, we're new for my critterpedia, my critterpedia, and the bell cricket, which was new for the museum. Uh, but then we also didn't successfully get a painting that was worthwhile getting. So both of that crap. Uh, for all of that, I'll give you ten bells. I'll sell. Ugh. 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 Alright, well, that'll do it just about for this week's installment of Animal Crossing City Folk. Bitter disappointment all around. That's that's what today is all about. Let me run into the Able Sister shop just for, you know, S S and G's. See what they got in stock. I got a Wario nose, it looks like. Welcome, John. Thank goodness it's Friday. So, John, will you be able to rest up tomorrow? What's that? What am I doing tomorrow? Why, nothing in particular. I'll most likely be sewing and embroidering. You know, like I do every weekend. It's fair. Oh, no, is that... That's not a Wario mustache. I think it's a... Mu it's a... Mi Mario mustache. I don't know why I said it was Wario. Wario's got the zigzag, Mario's got the... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, anyway. Okay, well... I feel defeated. I feel utterly defeated. So I guess... I guess that is where I'll sign off for today. And for this week here on Animal Crossing, City Folk. I, I'm sorry I couldn't be... Less disappointing, I'll say. <laughs> but anyway, uh, better luck next week, I suppose, as we continue trying to find the Petal Tail Dragonfly before the end of the month, which is fast approaching. So next week, next week's episode is it. So, you know, we'll see. Fingers crossed. Anyway, uh, maybe next week we'll also get a not forged painting from Red as well. Uh, but in the meantime... I am the Nintendo Beast. If you are new, make sure to subscribe, ring that bell for notifications when I go live, when I upload new video content such as this, and uh, all kinds of other good stuff. So, I'm the Nintendo Beast, signing off.